it's going to freeze tonight. So, um, what we're going to do with our peppers, we're going to try to overwinter them. We've got five plants here. Um, and as you can see, some of them are still trying to ripen and grow. Um, my husband already picked the orange bell pepper before I got over here to videotape. Mm -hmm. So, um, these are our plants. I've got one here, one here, this, one here that's got a baby bell pepper on it. This will be our first attempt at overwintering peppers. Right, this is our first attempt. So that's one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, so um, this is the before, and we're going to go ahead and try to put these in a pot, and uh, we'll show you the finished product when we're done. Okay, bye. You can see we've uh, got all the peppers out of the bed, nothing left but mint, basil, and uh, Florida betony. So we're getting ready to put them in pots here. So the next thing we'll show you is uh, them all uh, repotted, and then we'll be taking them into the house to keep them warm. All right, be back in a sec. I just wanted to show you that we um, brought the plants in. Um, we've repotted all of the um, peppers. And uh, right now we haven't uh, harvested the peppers that were on it and are cut them back. We just kind of left them in here and uh, I've got, got six pots of peppers here because I've got the dragon pepper down here which was already in a pot and I've got uh, this is our orange yellow bell pepper this is the yellow bell pepper and this is the uh, macaroni pepper. This is our um, this is our orange bell pepper. And of course, I've got a little tree here. But we've got them in the house, and I'm trying to keep them warm. It's a little cool in this room, but um, it's not as cold as it is outside. So for now. Oh yeah, <laughs> also brought in our um, poinsettias here because um, they're not cold hardy down to 27. Yeah, so everything's uh, in here, staying warm. for now. I guess uh, I'll just say happy farming. Bye.